Well hello everyone, it's Robrix here, and today I'm taking a look at this LEGO City set, it's set number 7286, it's called the Prisoner Transport from 2011, it came with 173 pieces, 2 minifigures, and in the UK this set used to retail for £13.99. And this was actually my first ever LEGO set, yes that's right, I got it after a trip to Legoland in May 2013, and I really like this set, and today I'm going to be reviewing this set. Here is the instruction manual, which you can see is completely battered. Um, I've had it for a very long time, so yeah, it's got little rips and tears and everything. Um, but we do actually have quite a lot of ads in this, which is great. We even have a comic, which is really nice. And for the ads, I'll just show you. There we go. We have the 2010 airport sets, and I have the big airport set and the uh, repair truck, which I did a review of. Um, the police sets from 2011 and I think I have every 2011 police set uh, it was a very good wave of sets actually I must say uh, some more as the space sets from 2011 again another good wave and the fire sets from 2010 as well and I think that's it oh Lego Club ad as well and yeah that's it we get two minifigures in the set and the first one is this generic looking police officer um, his face is very simple, but it's still nice. A nice, a nice torso print as well. The standard cap. And no printing on the back for this minifigure. The other minifigure we get is this robber. And I like his face print with that gold tooth. That looks really cool. He's got this torso print um, with this prison uh, suit outfit, which is kind of cool. He's got a cap there and he's got a rucksack attached to his neck with some money inside, which is pretty cool. And yeah, that's about it for this minifigure. The robber in this set has a really cool looking dirt bike and let's take a look at it now. It's a nice orangey color, as you can see. There's only a few pieces uh, used to make the dirt bike, but it's still very, very nice. And the robber can attach to it and like so and now it can make its escape beep beep and here is the prisoner transport and it looks really nice we'll start by looking at this crate here which has quite a few accessories in it we've got a walkie talkie a torch a megaphone a pair of handcuffs and this blue light thingy majiggy and they can all go in the crate which is pretty cool like so and this can go into this little compartment here, and I'll show you that in a minute. Um, let's start by looking at the prisoner transport. We'll look at the front where we get two stickers, one for the number plate and one for this police sign, which is really nice. It looks really modern overall, which I really like. We get these blue cheese slopes on either side for the mirrors, which is very nice. We get these pieces for the horns, and on the top it says number three police, which is cool. We have opening doors on either side, which is a rarity now in most LEGO sets. So it's nice to see it in this set. Um, there's this side. There's the back. And I'll show you that in a minute. On the top, we've got a light, which can be adjusted. Um, it can move a full 360, which is nice. And there is a light at the back as well, which can move like so, which is pretty cool. And yeah, I'll show you the inside actually first. So this can come off the roof. And inside we have space for one minifigure, and it does come with a steering wheel and a cup of something, which is very nice. We can put the roof back on, like so. And this compartment can open, like so. And there's quite a lot of space in there. And I'll take this bit off as well, so you can see it. There we go. It's very smooth, because it's tiled in there, which is very nice. And you can put the crate in, like so. And there's loads of space inside, as you can see. You can definitely fit uh, a lot more accessories in there, which is very nice. And to uh, take a look at the back now, these doors can open. There's two stickers for the uh, police sign, which is cool. And there's also a lot of space in here as well, where we can put our robber, which is pretty cool. And there's a look at it from the top. There's definitely a lot of space in there, which is nice. And we've got these jail windows on either side. And yeah, it's pretty nice. And that's about it for this uh, prisoner transport. It's a very, very nice modern van. And now we'll take a look at the recommendations. 
Overall, I think this is a really nice set. Uh, we'll start with the value first. And the price in the UK was £14. In the US, it was $20. And for 173 pieces, I think that's a good value. Um, you definitely feel like you're getting uh, £14 worth of Lego here. The van is quite big. Not too big, it's a decent size. Um, we also get a really cool dirt bike as well, which is nice. We also get a lot of accessories in this set, as you saw before. We got a walkie-talkie, a pair of handcuffs, some money, just loads of accessories, which is really nice. And the van itself is very realistic, it's very modern looking, and I really like that. Um, there's also lots of space inside as well. And this set um, is also very nostalgic to me as well, so that's why I like this set a lot. Um, but besides from that, I still think this is a really good set. I think it is the best uh, police van that LEGO have done in LEGO City. So if you can find this set on eBay or Bricklink or wherever uh, for a decent price, I would highly recommend it. This is a great set. Um, thanks guys for watching this video. Make sure to uh, like, comment and subscribe for more LEGO content. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye!